Hey guys, it's Brennan the Paleo Dude. I'm out in Langley. Um, I'm helping my friend Jolena with a science project on um, invasive species. So, if you guys have not known, here in BC there is a lot of invasive fish species, loads. And a majority of them were introduced back in the day um, as game fish or as um, bait. And um, most of which can be found here in this pond. I think this is Bryden Lagoon. You're not allowed to fish in here or whatever. Um, oh look, there's a dragonfly. So anyways, we, we got like the majority of them. We've got the, um, the brown bullheads. They're a type of catfish and they grow massive, like absolutely huge. Um, you can't really see them now. If I can just get some to the top. They get huge, but for some reason we're only catching baby ones. There's one there, kind of, kind of has like a body of a tadpole. And then that long fish right there is a fathead minnow. Um, the male and female look very different. I think it's uh, one of them that has this huge round head, um, hence their name, fathead minnow. And the majority you can see have very small, thin heads. Oh, and we got a fish that passed, whoops. Anyways, so we ignored the dead one. Hmm? Probably not a good idea. Oh, where's its head at? And um, we also have pumpkin seed sunfish. Um, I can try and get one out of the water. Oh, and it seems like, is that a bladder snail floating around in there? Okay, so we're gonna get the pumpkin seed out. So again, all these fish are invasive. But you can see they're very colorful. Let's get them out in the sun. They got vibrant greens and blues, and then like a more yellowy bottom. They're very pretty, but again, very bad for the environment. They outcompete our local fish for food, eat their eggs, eat their babies, stuff like that. Um, there's a catfish clinging on to the net with its spikes. So these catfish have really big backward facing spikes, and those help them avoid getting eaten by predators like the big owl. They even hurt when they're young. Um, the big, big, um, what are those, herons? Herrings? The, the cranes, the big, big birds, right, with long necks. So those guys, they, they can really um, avoid getting eaten by them, and they get huge, like big, very big. So yeah. Hi. So how big can the bull fit, they feel like this big? They, they can't see us. A little smaller? Like, yeah, like that big. <laughs> <laughs> and then pumpkin seeds are like, you know, I can't, I'm holding my camera, but you know. Fairly large, they're like that big. Yeah, they get huge. <laughs> and it's crazy, their heads like stay the same size as a certain age and their bodies just get bigger. So you get to like this tiny head on this big fish. So yeah, no, Bryden Lagoon's full of invasive fish. Very sad. Um, what's that all the way out there? Huh. A seagull. No, in the water, right there. Oh, it's just another one of those. Okay. Just another fountain. Fountain, yeah. But it, that, that's what sucks oh. in the water for that one. And look how poopy the water is. Like, that's all these birds poo. The water smells so bad. I got a lot on me right now. Can't wait to take a shower. So yeah, there we go. Hope you guys enjoyed this um, video. A little different from what I usually do, but of course, my uh, second major interest is marine biology and uh, that includes freshwater environments so yeah no again um, if you guys want to see more videos like this let me know in the comments down below until next time i'll see you all in the next video bye bye